actually, the project first started around 2011 with the floods in Bangkok, and so a lot of our older dogs have been here since then. And since then, um, they've been taking in rescues from puppy mills and building an awareness of treating dogs more humanely and spaying and neutering. All of our dogs are rabies-free. There's a, over about 500 dogs, so there's a lot of hay that's needed. We had to put a lot of hay in their houses because in Chiang Mai at night it gets quite cold. It's kind of the responsibility of humans to make sure that their life is better. And I think that's one of the best you know, gifts that we can give as a human is just that act of service to make the life better of animals, all animals. You know, In working with the dogs, you really see their, their appreciation and their love and their trust. And that's just something that you can't really take for granted. When the volunteers were spreading out the hay today, the dogs were just so happy. We put it in the house, we put them up on the loft so that the dogs can make a nest and they can be quite warm. To them, it's like this big party and they, they absolutely love the hay. Um, a lot of our dogs, they like to just, all the smells, they think it's wonderful, so they get very excited. They're beautiful, they're so special. Each one is so unique and they all have their own personalities and how important it is. The volunteers come from all over the world, but we all have that common love of animals. Everyone to work together and there's no job that's too small. We're all connected and we all can have that service for the animals here and just providing a message to the world that this type of sanctuary is possible and educating other people in other countries. We should be respecting all kinds of life and just wanting to make the world a better place.